Well, anyway, some people have asked for seeing a few more of your drawing videos because uh, it's amazing to watch you just out of thin air sketch up a design. I don't know. Great piles of petrified picture. I, I can't understand that. But uh, uh, Well, whatever, man. I'll be glad to help out any way I can. Well, a customer contacted you and wanted a firehouse. This is, I guess. Uh, and. And you had an old firehouse here that was for sale, but you wanted to design a completely new firehouse. Well, that firehouse was sold to Scott Nichols okay. a long time ago. Right. Plus, I'm selling individuality. And anything I sell, the customer has a one of a kind. Nowhere else on this planet is they going to find that unless somebody wants to copy me exact. Now, you've come the closest in copying my style, and I take my hat off to you. Well, thank you. For doing a hell of a job. That's a new, uh, a new hat. Oh, yeah, this way I can curse without be feeling guilty. I give people a warning. Well, let's mm. see. Let's go over to your pad of paper here because, ah, again, sure. this mm. is going to be for a firehouse. Well, and we'll start with a floor plan. This firehouse is pretty simple. Now, this is HO scale. So, floor plan, we'll start with this the basic structure over here. Is that too a little light? darker? A little darker. There you go, Howard. Okay. And we'll build a basic proportion. Mm hmm. Now this will be a two stall firehouse. It's one door and two doors. Okay. Over here will be a this will be a a tie tower for drying the hoses. Uh -huh. Okay. The roof wise we're gonna have the roof come this way here. It'll be a gable roof. Okay, now I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Now we gotta have a little building for the train shows uh -huh. that the firehouses have. So I built this little annex over here. Also, the crew, the firemen can sleep in here if need be. This won't be anywhere as large. It'll be like about up to here. And this roof will come this way here. This way here. Now, we have to erase these lines. Why? You'll see. The top view of this roof. But look like this here. Ah, shit on the stick. Did you get that? Mm. Oh. Okay, there you go. Now, we're going to put a cupola on this. Why? Because this firehouse was built in the 1890s. There was no air conditioning. So we'll put a cupola right about in the center. And now we'll put a smokestack. We'll put the the stack, maybe a stack over here, uh -huh. a smoke jack off the side. This will be the top of the smoke jack. It could be on an angle, and this could be an actual chimney. We'll put over here. Folks on my channel, you, you Howard did a bakery for me, the Pugs, uh, Pugsbury Bakery, and then you did another drawing on uh, an engine house that we're gonna, I'm gonna build uh, in O scale, mm -hmm. and then you did another drawing, and again it's all on my channel, folks. You just go into uh, my videos, and you can see Howard doing this. Uh, you did an incredible one on a mansion that you that you just built. Yeah. This part's easy. Then we're going to have a door here, have a window here, uh -huh. and a window here. We'll put two windows here, one there, and one there. And we'll have windows here, here, and a door. And a window here, and a window here. And we'll put two windows here. And we'll have two windows on this side. Oh, okay. Okay, that'll be the plan. Hmm? Now, you want to see what this will look like? Yes. I have no friggin' idea, but <laughs> <laughs> we'll see what we can do. How much time do I have to draw this son of a bitch? Uh, well, it's up to you. We're at mm -hmm. six minutes. All right. It's amazing how fast, folks. Okay, we're going to use the two-point perspective. Now, do you understand between the difference between a two-point, one-point, and three-point perspective? No. Okay, well, two-point... 
you have a vanishing point here and a vanishing point here. And you have the eye level, then you have the further. But we'll just rough it in. I'll get into that later. That's part of your training. Okay, we'll start, uh, let's see. We'll start over here. This will be a two-point perspective. So this obviously has a low eye level. And, and we'll come down here very lightly at first. And the ground level. Go like that. Put a center line here. And we'll draw the doors in here. I hope there's no art teacher watching this. I'm flunk. It looks pretty good, Howard. So if I got you a big, giant John Ross wig, you wouldn't wear it. <laughs> it catch me dead in that fucking thing. Oh, boy. In all seriousness, okay, he, was, a, he was an this awesome This would be player. higher because the trucks are higher. Mm -hmm. So this thing here, this roof would come out. See the way this line goes? Mm -hmm. We'll follow this out. And I'll show you how to connect these to vanishing points at a later date. Mm -hmm. So you know how to... Remember, I promise you... I'm going to teach you how to sketch. Yeah, right now I sketch, and he's okay. like, what the hell now is this? this over here, so this vanishing point will come down here, and we'll have this here. Okay, now the roof, we're going to get a, this will be a picket roof or a gable roof, but it's going to be on a, a platform, raised platform. Now, again, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. I have no idea what I'm doing. Goes up here. Let's get this some bitch up this way here. Remember, I'm unfiltered now, according right. to my hat. You know exactly what you're doing, Howard. This <laughs> thing looks. Come on, man. Every I'm sketch you've done has been a home run. I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. Oh, please. <laughs> Folks, wait till you see this thing. Okay, this will be the cupola. That'll fit right about here. And yeah, this will be the base. Remember, a cupola's got three parts. you got a base, center section, which can be windows or vents, and you have a roof. So this is the lower part. This is the base. And then this part will go in here. This will be the midsection or the window section. This will be a pretty wide Cooper, it will look good. Okay, now I'm not going to be able to fit it all on the page, but I'll get an idea. Okay, up here will be a logo for the firehouse and a sign in here says firehouse. Okay, in here will be a door. That's for the get into the train show. Mm -hmm. be a small show but what the hell put a window here and I told you that rough always put on By shitty, you get to see it just to get a better picture of it. Mm -hmm. Okay, this will have three windows in here. Just rough this in here. I don't want to use all your time up or nothing. Okay. Then the tower, the drying tower will be back in here.
Okay, now this will be wood. We'll probably do this in planking. Actually, we'll have a... Uh, that'd be a window over here. Uh -huh. This is pretty rough, just roughing this in now. Right. here well thank you for thinking I know what the hell I'm doing you well that's a work in progress Howard but that was a a nice little build and it's, it's not done off. yet it's not weathered yet. The roof has to be done. Yeah, it's. It was a it was to be cedar shake shingles, so I gotta lift some of them up. Mm hmm. Price some up, look. Yeah, it's a work in progress, but it's mm. very handsome. This is where the drying tower will go over here, this side. Mm hmm. And when this is done, we will do another episode of it. And these. Well, I have are... another firehouse to make. Oh, do you? Uh, uh, Mike go up in the Bluebell. Mm -hmm. Okay. And. Yeah. Folks, these are available uh, in HO scale and O scale. And if you decide you want one, contact us at alpug1 at verizon.net right. and we can get you a price. Well, let's talk a little bit more about these. Number one, one thing I will not do. Now, you may, but I will not. So I will not copy anything. If you want to send me a drawing mm -hmm. or a photograph of what you want built, forget it. Right. Unless I approve or like, let me reiterate, love the design. Right. I'll build it. It'll be a challenge. But most okay. of the times, I would say 80% of the stuff request I get for structures or people want me to build this or build that. And I'm just not going to do it because I look like hell. Plus, right. it's not me. It's not my design. Right. To me, the total artwork is to start from inception, which is the drawing, which you just saw, right. to completion or yes. fruition, whatever you want to call it. Yes. That is fun. To copy something is not art. Maybe it'd be craftsmanship in building it, but it's not art. It's only art when I can design it and build it. Well, it's a very now, nice... Now, this is my opinion. This is not gospel. That's the way I see things. Right. You may see it differently. That's okay. Because I respect, I respect your beliefs and you respect mine. Yes. And I happen to like this. <laughs> Did you get my ponytail? No. Here, skip my ponytail. Uh, yeah. it, it, yeah, it looks, looks all right. It's getting there. George Washington. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> well, Howard, let's. Uh, we well, got this is about day in the shops. You got other other episodes. That's you right. Want to talk about stay stay tuned for an upcoming episode of Day in the Shop, and I'll post this uh, shortly. And thanks, thanks, Howard. Whoa, I appreciate whoa, whoa, it. Whoa, 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 whoa! As you were, as you were. Show them what your progress on your thing. That's beautiful. Oh, that, that's going to be in a day in the shop. Sure? That's yep. A, well, this is a day in the shop. Well, no, this is going to be... This is five minutes in the shop. This is going to be mm. just the, the firehouse. So, folks, stay tuned. You'll see another episode of A Day in the Shop. Okay. Thanks, well, Howard. You're quite welcome. Thank you.